Create the proposed site plan. A microstation document file is called a design file, or DGN. It is composed of one or more models, each of which is used to store related elements such as lines, arcs, and shapes. When you create a DGN file, MicroStation copies one of the provided templates or seed DGN files to the new file. You can have only one DGN file open at a time. If you open a DGN file when one is already open, the first file automatically closes. It is possible to open up multiple instances of MicroStation, each with a different active file. In this lesson, you will create a new site plan DGN file that will contain the design graphics for our proposed site development project. While you work through the lessons in this course, you will learn, create a DGN file, use a seed file. Continuing in the MicroStation Connect edition, from the work page, pick new file. The new dialog opens. From here, navigate to the folder MS Basic Civil DGN 01 Introduction to MicroStation folder. This is the location that we wish to save the new file to. Next to the seed field, click the browse button. From here, navigate to the standards seed folder in the course data set. Select the Civil 2D Seed DGN and then click Open to select it. In the Name field, name the new DGN file Proposed Site Plan and pick Save. The new DGN file is created and opened. From the View window, observe that the new file is 2D. This was determined by the Seed file. Seed files help bring consistency to a project. When a DGN file is created, a seed file is identified as a template for the new DGN file. The new DGN file is actually a copy of the seed file containing the same settings and properties as that of the seed. This includes any models, design graphics, reference file attachments, etc. It is because of this that organizations may have different seed files based upon department, discipline, or the type of content that will be in the DGN. In this case, the seed file that was used was adapted from a seed file obtained from our customer. As such, it contains many of the basic settings that they want in their project design files. In the top left corner of the view window, from the View Tools, along the edge of the View window, pick Fit View. The tool settings are set to Files All. MicroStation immediately attempts to fit any geometry that has been created within the View window. View the status bar. A message is reported stating, No elements found. The file contains no graphical content that is displayed. Take note that MicroStation has the ability to display up to eight view windows simultaneously in the Active Design session. MicroStation, in general, follows a three-step rule when working with tools. This three-step rule is, first, pick the tool, next, adjust the tool settings, then, follow the command prompt. In this case, pick the tool was choosing the fit view icon. Next, adjusting the tool settings was not necessary because the tool was already set to Files All. And then, in this case, the tool was executed immediately because there is a single view window in use. With other tools, this is not the case. The command prompt will walk you through the use of the active tool. During this lesson, you learned how to create a MicroStation design file and how to select and apply a seed file when a design file is created. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.